Nestled in between South Africa and Tanzania on the east coast of the African continent, Mozambique sees far fewer visitors than its more famous neighbours. But with a coastline that stretches for over 1500 miles, it is a destination like no other for beach lovers. In some places, the swaths of white or golden sand are semi-deserted, allowing you to snorkel, swim or sunbathe in peace. Whereas in the more livelier places, you can embrace the laid-back pace of local life as you watch fishermen bring in their catches on wooden dowels and the women in their colourful skirts searching for supper in the shallows. My list today is of some of the best beaches that Mozambique has to offer. The spectacular island of the Bazarito Archipelago in Mozambique is known for their unspoilt beauty and peace that surpasses all human understanding. The pristine coral reefs are home to over 2,000 species of fish as well as dolphins and whales. It goes without saying that the diving and snorkeling in the Bazarito National Park is something you'll never forget. Some of the other activities include diving, kayaking, parasailing, as well as snorkeling in what has been dubbed the Aquarium. Majombe Island This tiny private island is often touted as one of the most romantic destinations in the Kurambas. It is really only accessed via air transfer from Pemba and as you begin the descent towards Majombe, you'll be greeted by the unforgettable sight of a spit of pure white sand reaching out across the swirling turquoise and deep blue canvas of the Indian Ocean. The entire island is surrounded by expanses of deserted sand which you'll share with nesting sea turtles when they're in season. Ponta de Ora When you get there, a golden ribbon of sand set between the Cotarina covered dunes and the warm blue waters of the Indian Ocean awaits. Ponta de Ora is known as a tourist hotspot for surfers, fishermen and scuba divers with spectacular reef sites including the legendary shark diving spot known as the Pinnacles. Tofo Beach Tofo Beach is one of the mainland favourites for holidaymakers in search of laid-back tropical living. It combines world-class diving and surfing with sun-drenched beaches and a vibrant nightlife scene. The main beach is a thick swath of golden sand, conveniently located just steps from bars with balconies perfect for sipping ice-cold beers in the sun. Vilanculus A holiday favourite for many, Vilanculus is located about 750 kilometres north of Maputo and is by far one of the easiest beaches to access with tar roads that are suitable for regular vehicles. Like the majority of Mozambique's best beaches, this one has a fantastic local vibe and is always stocked with lots of fresh fruits and vegetables. It's an ideal destination for those who are keen on outdoor sports with activities such as kite and windsurfing which are pretty popular. Pemba Island Although Pemba is surrounded by a fine coral reef and pristine seas, 
Its shores are also franked with dense mangrove forests and the beaches can take a bit of hunting out and getting to. Pemba has remained virtually unknown to the hordes of beach-bound tourists with just a couple of luxury lodges and the island is mainly visited by those who come to dive and snorkel its coral reefs and channels. Gosa National Park and Limpopo National Park. Although the next two entries are not typically beaches, I think that they deserve an honourable mention as both of these national parks are stunningly beautiful. Gorongosa National Park is perhaps Africa's greatest conservation story. By adopting a 21st century conservation model of balancing the needs of wildlife and people, the government is protecting and saving this beautiful wilderness, returning it to its rightful place as one of Africa's greatest parks. The Limpopo National Park forms part of the Great Limpopo and Transfrontier Park. The park is home to many mammal species including elephants, lions, leopards, mongoose, giraffe, zebra and many others. The park has three separate zones, a tourist zone, a wilderness zone and a resource utilisation zone. The first tourism facilities were opened in 2005 with phase two of tourism development beginning in 2008. In Hakka Island Across the bay from Maputo lies the island of Inhaka. Despite its close proximity to civilization, the island feels far removed from everyday hustle and bustle of the Mozambican capital. The island is known as a dune forest with mangrove thickets surrounded by several Mozambican beaches. To experience the true Mozambican culture, head to the beach directly in front of the Inhaka village. Here you can sit and watch the locals go about their daily business. Best activities here are scuba diving and snorkeling. Quirinbus Islands Quiet and out of the public eye, the archipelago of Quirinbus is the place to go if you're looking for the entire meaning of peace and quiet. The spectacular Kurumbus Islands are a massive unexplored chain of 32 Indian Ocean Islands along the northern coast of Mozambique, each with their own amazingly beautiful beaches. This is paradise in every sense of the word, but it is a rather out of reach destination, so you should be prepared for more than a day's stay. Lake Malawi Lake Malawi, also known as Lago Nyasa in Mozambique, is an African great lake and the southernmost lake in the East African Rift System located between Malawi, Mozambique and Tanzania. It is the second deepest lake in Africa and home to more species of fish than any other lake in the world. The Mozambique portion of the lake was officially declared a reserve by the government in 2011. Lake Malawi has for millennia provided a major food source to the residents of its shores since the waters are rich in fish. With water temperatures of between 24 to 29 degrees Celsius, you can swim all year round. So there you go guys, 10 of the best beaches from Mozambique. I really hope that you enjoyed the video. This one was made especially for one of my viewers, Prince Danny. So, like everyone else, I hope that you enjoyed the video too. Please everyone, remember to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more great content just like this. Also, if you have any suggestions, leave them down in the comments section. Until next time, please stay safe. Bye bye.